All right, I'm back, yay. Um, so this is going to be an unassembled traveler's notebook standard size insert. Um, you are gonna see everything you get. Um, everything has been trimmed down. Scraps are all included for additional decorations as well as felt stickers, chipboard buttons, um, different wood pieces and embellishments, charms. Um, muslin scraps, stickers, and all of that. Um, and also um, four ribbon paper clips. So all that, I'm not gonna open and go through those. They're all pretty much, I mean, <clears throat> I don't know who they're from, but they're all Halloween themed. So that, and these are all made, the covers are made with hanging file folders. Oh, I gotta take these out. Uh, let's see if I can do this. There we go. Um, so this is the fabrics that I used in the other ones, as well as the ribbon scraps that I used for the tabs. Um, six, I believe, in each. So um, everything is the same equally among the four, the two that are not assembled, and two that are. And let's see. So I did not do anything to the inside. If you want to do cheesecloth around to give it that extra old grungy look, I did include all of the pages which I had trimmed for use. Uh, where's the other one? There it is. On the inside cover. So those are all gonna be included. <coughs> And then, uh, like I said, all of the scrappy bits from all of the pages. Um, these are also great just to fold as you saw if you watched the first one. If you haven't watched that, definitely. Link will be down below. Um, sometimes when I have a wider scrap that's long, I just fold it in half and use it for journaling. But there are the same amount of pages in each. The same assortment of pages in each. Uh, they all have one of these little baggies. Everything's coffee dyed except for the color book pages as uh, stated in the first one as well. So, and then this is the piece that I do for the center if you want to leave it open for journaling or if you want to make it an envelope and I guess we could do a quick flip through I don't know if anyone's going to be too particular on you know which papers they have in their insert if you want to be I will show you all sides okay um, I don't remember how many exactly are in there, but that is that one. I'm going to pause and be right back with the second one. All right, so I'm back. Here is the second unassembled standard size. There's the cover. They both have, or they all have the gauze on the, um, around. So we'll go ahead and open this one. Again, the scraps of fabric and tab ribbons as well as the scraps of paper oh, I forgot to take those out <laughs> um, and there is a tag in this one so let's see these are the inside papers and then this is just a scrap of what was left of this page. So you can fussy cut that or make it a pocket somewhere. <clears throat> and we'll do a flip of these pages. Oops. Well, hey. Okay. <laughs> This is tricky to show. 
So, um, you know, um, the ones I assembled, I sewed these to make them tuck so you can leave it open as a flip. However you want to assemble that, whatever your little heart desires, um, you can do it. There is nothing that has been pre-done aside from trimming and folding to fit. There's the center page. Go through the last half. that is that now will be the second one um, again if you are interested please check the links below for my Etsy store where they will be listed and if they are not there please hold tight because I am making more all right thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one Toodle.